Supra versus NSX. This is a big one, folks. Brand new Supra, brand new NSX. Chuck Walla Valley Raceway, sunny day, Southern California. Driver Battles is here. And we got two of my newest friends, Arlen and Jay. And we're gonna duke it out in the desert today. Arlen, let's start with you. You got a Supra. You brought yes, a sir. Supra to a dog fight. Yeah, I brought a Supra to a dog fight. Yeah. Uh, of course, the NSX is the totally different caliber of car. For me, you know, I just take the opportunity to come out here. The Supra has a few key points that I think it might have an advantage, like for weight. But other than that, Jay's got like double the horsepower. So there it goes from there. Yeah, but it's not called horsepower battles. It's called driver battles. It is called driver battle. Yeah. So we'll see how it goes. I'm fairly new to the track. Uh, this is literally my fourth track day. Wow. So. We'll see how I do out there. Um, first time experience with the Supra with a good tire that definitely has a lot more grip than what I was on before, basically stock tires. So let's see what I could do out there. Yeah, speaking of, how are the tires doing? The tires are actually doing really well. Yeah. They're being very consistent. Um, I like the response I'm getting from them. A lot less understeer, of course, versus the stock tire having a more aggressive compound. So I'm definitely very pleased with the tire. Nice, nice. And how many laps do you think you've done today so far? Yeah, I'm like, maybe over 12. <laughs> wow, yeah, and they're still holding up. Yeah, they're still holding up. Awesome. And I have been on the tires in other events and they're still, they're still doing really well. Heck yeah, Yeah. heck yeah, awesome. All right, Jay. Yes. The loudest car we've ever had on, not in terms of sound, but in terms of color. Yeah. You think you can take out that Supra and your buddy Arlen over here? We'll try. Okay. Like, we've been uh, actually doing track days for quite a minute. Oh, wow. We battled with the BRZ, not this one. Yeah? So this is the first time. Uh, Jay's pretty fast. <laughs> not really. Wow. No, not really. <laughs> so this might actually have an opportunity for a friendly rivalry. Yeah. Loser buys gas. Loser Losers. buys Korean barbecue. Yes. Your NSX sounds crazy. What has been done to it? Uh, basically just downpipes, uh, JB4, and just no tune. That's about it. Oh, OK. Yeah. What's been down to your Supra? Uh, I have a valved exhaust system. Yeah. I have a catless downpipe, but no tune as well. So I'm still running stock power. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. All wheel drive? All wheel drive. Rear wheel drive? Rear wheel drive. Oh man. Why do you think the NSX is going to beat the Supra today? So it's fast. Yeah. Let's just say it. And being the first time here at the track, like I think, I think we can get Arlen this one. Okay. Yep. You think you can get him? Yep. All right. How are the NT01s doing for you? It's very consistent all throughout. There's no fall off, so I really like the tires. And awesome. compared to you know other tires, like it just gets greasy. Yeah. This one is just very consistent. Heck yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Arlen, I'm not trying to scare you, but he's gonna be coming for you, man. Almost definitely. So I'll just I'll just try to do my best, see what I can do. I mean, I set a time, I set a time, yeah. you know, it's all a learning experience. Yeah. So just definitely grateful for the opportunity. So it'll be a good time. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I'm excited to see what a Supra versus the NSX can do. I hope you're excited to watch it. If you want to join our driver battles, we run them time attack style. That means these drivers have an open track all day long. There is no traffic. There is no wheel to wheel racing. It's a wonderful opportunity for them to get out there and get some seat time. And if you want to be a part of it, make sure you click the link somewhere around my face and sign up. We want to hear from you. We want to see your comments. We want you to join us. And the only way you can is if you click the link and sign up. But enough of me talking. Are you guys ready to go do battle? All right, I'll let you shake hands, punch each other, hug, do whatever you want to do. It's a friendly rivalry. May the best man win. Korean barbecue. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
it's time to end the driver battle that might be the most debated. New Supra versus new NSX. You might think, hey, we're crazy. The NSX is faster than a Supra. What are you doing? Well, the Supra is known to be tunable. The Supra has been known to understate their horsepower numbers. On paper, it's a great matchup. You do have turbos, you do have turbos. You have rear wheel drive on a high speed track and you got all wheel drive in a hybrid. So there's a weight difference there. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a close battle. Arlen, how do you think you did it? Personally, I think I did pretty well for myself and considering my experience level, I don't have much seat time. This is literally, like I said, my fourth track day earlier in the interview, but I'm overall happy with my progress. If I lose, I lose. I did my best with what I could do today. Yeah. Jay, how do you think the NSX did? Pretty good today. Yeah. Even though um, we had like some hiccups earlier, but now it's, it's pretty good. That's good. Yeah. Is the NSX a good track car? Yes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes and that. no. <laughs> yes and no. Yes, with with some tuning, if we have suspension, yes. Oh really? But so far, there's no one can unlock the ECU. Yeah. So we're stuck at like stock horsepower. Right. Right. Yeah. And then you're saying that sometimes it goes into limp mode and you get like half your power? Yeah, right now it's on limp mode. Oh, wow. So it's very equal. So I'm curious enough, like what's the time? Oh, wow. Yeah. So all day long you've been driving on limp mode? Yeah, it's on limp oh, mode. Oh, is this a racer's excuse or is this real, Arlen? No, it's real. I know okay. this car has issues. <laughs> you know, you know. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I've seen this car. All right, all right, good, good. Wow, okay, so that actually level playing field. Then. Yeah. Okay, Arlen. Two minutes, eight seconds. Oh, wait, really? Yes, sir. I didn't believe that. Yeah. Holy crap. Two minutes, eight seconds. You improved considerably, didn't you? Yeah, that's the fastest time I've ever set, period. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's fantastic, man. Why do you think you did so good? Um, honestly, this is the most difficult track I've been to. Yeah. It took a lot of finessing on my part, being more smooth with the car, my braking points, my steering, throttle input, everything. And also, you know, like pointers I've gotten from more experienced drivers like Jay, yeah. <laughs> who definitely, even though we're in a competition, you know, we're still really good friends. Yeah. So I definitely took a lot from him too and saw how he was driving and it definitely helped me improve my own driving and taught me a lot on how I should be taking this track yeah. and with my current setup and finding my limitations. And I, I just didn't think I was gonna do, I would be happy with a sub 210, but yeah. I was like. <laughs> yeah, it's a great time. It's a great time, honestly, for what? Your first time in Chuck Wall? This is my first time on Chuck Wall. Heck yeah. All right, Jay, 159.8. I'm just gonna tell you right now, you won. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Shake hands, do whatever you guys wanna do. 159.8, good job, Jay. That's pretty close. That's pretty close. Yeah, I mean, you're first timer, and then you've been here maybe once before yeah. in the NSX. Was the NSX really just that much better of a machine today over the Supra? Was it the driver? What was it? My actual PB was with Sam. Yeah? With a passenger. Oh, wow. Yeah. Giving him a ride. <laughs> yeah. Okay, like for just a fun lap today, yeah. And we actually set the PB and it was like, whoa, sh <laughs> <laughs> yeah. nice. Yeah. Well, okay, we'll take that. Yeah. That's wow. why it's like it's fun. That's awesome. Awesome. Yeah. How the tires do for you today? Uh, very consistent till right now. Yeah. I was like, what time is it? Like four? Yeah. 4 p.m.? Yeah, it's yeah, so, so consistent. How the tires do for you? The tires did very amazing. Um, very consistent. I could feel exactly like when the drop off was, but it wasn't too crazy to the point where like I'm going to fly off track. But it was very easily readable, easy to manage tire pressures, things like that. It was, it was a great tire. Nice, nice. I'm glad you guys had a great time. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to be on the next Driver Battle, give us a like, give us a comment, give us a subscribe. If you think you're faster than them, let us know in the comments. But make sure to click the sign up link and let us know you want to come here. We'll see the comment, we'll see your registration, and we'll call you out. We'll bring you to the track. We make this series because of you guys and we want to make sure we keep bringing them to you. So let us know if you want more. Thank you guys for coming out. Thanks so much to Nitto Tire and Driving Line for having us and we will see you guys on the next Driver Battle. Thanks for watching Driving Line. If you guys like this video, consider subscribing to our channel so you'll never miss any of the content we create here. Whether you're into trucks, Jeeps, imports, domestic vehicles, or anything in between, we are here to fuel your passion. So hit that subscribe button and we'll see you guys next time.